Hi, it's Dr. Chris. I'm back with two more questions of the week. I'm really liking these. I got some great questions in here. Happy to answer them. I urge you to keep them coming, even if you make up a bunch of crap, like I'm about an going to answer uh, on the second question. The first question, good question, Do, does stretching lengthen short muscles? So, I went on, did some research on it, found something at uh, MIT, Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Thank you very much. I would hope those are pretty smart people there. They say no. They said that uh, some muscle fibers stretch back to the normal range of motion. Let's suppose that might, might be what you have when you're like 20 or whatever, when you're at your maximum motion, but usually not any past that and that some muscle fibers stay at their own uh, distance. So it depends on the muscle, but they did say one thing. If you stretch, you can gain more flexibility, but most importantly, after you start stretching, to continue to stretch over time, uh, we lose our elasticity, and stretching can help that. So don't stop stretching because like all the other exercises, you lose what you don't use. For me, it's very frustrating here. What should I do about this? What should I do about that? I tell people what to do. They generally don't do it. Or they do it when they hurt and then it goes away. Not a good idea. The thing that's interesting about stretching any exercise is you need to do it consistently over long periods of time and stay up on it and then never quit. So, and then whatever happens is just the way that it is. Second question, is the earth really round? Huh? Hey, interesting. You know, I thought about that for a while. So we all know what the facts of the matter, right, is go see Bill Nye, the science guy. He would know. But this is what I really think. You know, if you're driving around a tractor in Illinois looking at the rows that go on like forever, looking around at your neighbors, the world is definitely flat. However, if you go up on a Sears Tower and you look over all that flat countryside, you can actually see the curvature of the earth. So, yes, the earth is round. What do you think?